There you are. Come, Ezio. I'd like to introduce you to an, uh, associate. This is Agostino Barbarigo, soon to be Doge of Venezia, thanks to you. È un onore fare la vostra conoscenza, illustrissimo. I'm sorry for the loss of your brother. He had it coming. He was bought and paid for by the Borgia. A mistake I have no intention of making. Come, Ezio. We have much to discuss. We've located Silvio Barbarigo for you. He's fled into l'arsenale. Ha! Fled? You mean occupied, and joined by 200 mercenari, no less. You're doge now. Can't you command them to stand down? The committee of 41 has yet to confirm my ascension. And this little stunt of Silvio's has only made things worse. He has an entire army at his command. Then help me to raise my own. I figured you'd say as much. Bartolomeo Dalviano is the man you seek. He and his men have little love for Silvio. He resides within the military district, southwest of L'Arsenale. Va bene. I'll go and see him. Silvio Barbarigo. Raised by wealthy merchants, Silvio was introduced to politics when his father was cut out of the family inheritance. From then on, Silvio worked for his uncle, his father's killer. Apparently, he had a knack for persuasion. Quickly, he became his uncle's advisor, proving his worth by discovering a Saranzo plot against the Barbarigos. You're gonna love this. Before the plot could be carried out, Silvio throws an Easter celebration, inviting the Saranzos. There's a pageant for the children in the central courtyard, while Silvio escorts the parents to the roof. He toasts the family, then signals the archers hidden behind the courtyard windows. The Saranzos never plotted against the Barbarigos again. Fast forward ten years, and Silvio's living in his uncle's luxurious Venetian palazzo. According to the history books, his uncle died in bed. <laughs> Silvio Barbarigo.
the public's foreign interests, a levy will be imposed upon all importation of goods deemed non-essential. Must be one of Bartolomeo's men. What's happened here? Where is he? Silvio Stocks attacked, took him deeper into the district. <coughs> North of here. Requiescat in pace. I should kiss you or slap you. Maybe both, just to be safe. That's quite all right. Who are you? I am Ezio Auditore da Firenze. I'm here to rescue you. <laughs> Let's see who winds up rescuing who. What do you mean? Down there! Stop them! All right. What? For the large one, Dante is called. Most of Silvio's men are useless, but that one's trouble. Ah, sweet freedom. How I have missed you. Silvio has set his men to ransacking your place. Prepare yourself for a fight. Finally, think that is true. No need. Go! Let's see what you can do. <laughs> Oh. Oh. Ah. 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 
Let's go. Time. Stay close. If you value your life, you'll stand down. Never! What good is a man's life if it's not lived free, eh? I'll not go back into a cage. Then you'll go into the ground. Kill them. Save them. What fun this will be! they've made. Bianca. I hope she is unharmed. Bianca! Bianca! Is everything all right? What do you think? Look at this place! And poor Bianca. If something's happened to her... Aha! Oh, my darling. Thank God you're all right. Ezio, meet Bianca. Bianca, Ezio. Charmed. So, I know your name. But not why you're here. I have business with Silvio Barbarigo. I was told you could help. Ah, it would be my honor. But it's going to require more than just the two. Three of us to weaken his forces. How do you suggest we proceed? I'll go and ready my men for battle. While I do this, I'd like you to rescue those who were captured during Silvio's assault. I cannot in good conscience leave them behind. In Daisy, I will attend to it at once. Good luck out there, Ezio. Many thanks for the aid, friend. We'd like to fight with you, if you'll have us. Follow my lead. With you, friend. Only lead the way. On me. Just leave me 
Together we will crush the Barbarigo! Welcome back, and well done. My host is restored to its former glory. Now Silvio will see just how grave a mistake he's made. How should we proceed? A direct assault against the Arsenale? No. We'd be massacred at the gates. I have something else in mind. Take my men and plant them throughout the district. The trouble they cause will force Silvio to dispatch most of his guards. And with the arsenale drained of mercenaries, I can move in for the kill. Exactly. You'll be virtually unopposed. Let's hope he takes the bait. Oh, don't worry. He will. This way. Yeah.
Wait here for my signal. As you wish. On me. Hold your ground here. Consider it done. Fall in. This is where you wait. Send word when it's time to strike. Your men are in place. Bene, bene. Take this. I assume you know how it works. Find the highest point you can in the district, and fire it from there. This signals my men to begin the attack. All right, then. I will see you on the battlefield. That you will. to the 
a shortage of funds after the recent campaign in defense of the Republic's foreign interests, a levy will be imposed upon all importation of goods deemed non-essential. To all citizens of the Bartolomeo needs my help. Arsenale! Excuse me, 
I don't know why you're here, Angel, but you're too late! There's enough of this for me! Enough of this! We're out of time! Return to me! We must depart! Ezio, go now! That brute will no doubt lead you straight to his master. My men and I will remain here and keep the guards from giving chase. Hurry! They're going to leave without us! What's happened here? Why the boats? I thought you saw the doge seat. Just a distraction. We were meant to sail. Sail where? I'll never tell. Cyprus is their destination. They want... They want... Non temete l'oscurità. Accettate il suo abbraccio. Requiescant in pace. Well done, Ezio! Silvio is defeated, and the military district is returned to us! Perhaps now Venezia might finally enjoy a bit of pace e tranquillità! We should celebrate this victory! I am glad for you and your men, Bartolomeo, but I cannot join. I fear my work has just taken a rather strange turn. What do you mean? Silvio wasn't looking to replace Marco as Doge. He was about to leave Venezia, in fact. This whole thing was just a distraction. Why? That is what I need to find out. 